requesting one million cash insurance bond. <laughs> Applause in the courtroom when a judge set a $1 million bond for a mother accused of sexually abusing her own baby. You know, before we go any further, we need to s take a minute and just warn you that this story is not one that you want your children to hear. But we do want you to know tonight that that child is safe and his mother is behind bars. 10 TV's A.J. Smith is live in our newsroom with the big story tonight. A.J.? Well, Andrea and Kurt, you are right. This is a tough story, really, for anyone to hear. Ashley Jessup is charged with raping a child under the age of 13. In fact, police believe she raped her infant son. Uh, next is Ashley Jessup. Note the defendant has exercised constitutional right to remain silent. Ashley Jessup stayed silent during her court arraignment one day after being arrested and charged with raping her 10-month-old son. Police say Jessup performed sex acts on the baby. She admitted videotaping the uh, acts and emailing the video to her boyfriend. The woman who answered the door at Jessup's address... Does Ashley Jessup live here? ...said she was Jessup's mother and asked us to stop um, filming. Like to... The woman didn't want to comment on camera, but she tells us she's humiliated and just trying to focus on caring for her 10-month-old grandson. She says she's going to fight to be able to continue to do so. For Jessup's neighbor in this Dublin apartment complex... It's a little disconcerting. I don't know that it really speaks um, for the neighborhood as a whole, um, but anytime you hear something like that as um, abhorrent as it is, it's, it definitely raises a few eyebrows. Brendan Zarnt has a 14-month-old daughter himself. I couldn't even imagine somebody doing that to a child, let alone their child. So uh, relating to it would be completely impossible. Impossible, but certainly punishable. And the state is requesting one million cash insurance bond. The judge set Jessup's bond at $1 million, and if convicted, this mother could spend the rest of her life in prison. Now, the woman we spoke to in Dublin says she is not worried about her grandson's recovery because she says he is too young to remember what happened. While she has not spoken to Jessup, she says she hopes that her daughter gets help in jail for what could be a mental illness. Now, Jessup is facing two felony charges of rape, but could face more charges related to making and emailing that video. A.J. Smith, 10TV News.